How's it going, YouTube live streamers? YouTube have added a subtle setting which is called channel level settings. As you can see here on the screen right now, we're gonna dive right in. What are channel level settings? These are basically your monetization defaults right now. That's all that's in there. Level channel settings for live streams. I suspect because they're calling it that and not calling it monetization, that they're gonna be adding more settings here. But specifically right now, all we've got are monetization defaults. Uh, I've already gone through and set mine up, but let's have a look at what the defaults are and how you can set them. Obviously, the key one, monetization on or off. Do you want it on by default or off by default? It's handy to have it all set up in advance so that when you set up a stream, it's automatically on if your default action is to have monetization on. So of course, you wanna set that on. Now, the important settings are everything after that because this is gonna determine how ads appear on during your live streams. Live ad settings, pre-roll ads will be inserted automatically. But how do you want mid-rolls to appear? You can let YouTube insert mid-rolls for you, which they recommend. As a viewer, from a viewing experience, it's a bit naff, if you ask me, um, having uh, witnessed it myself uh, in recent weeks. So I've set mine for me to choose how mid-rolls appear. Now, right un underneath that is just your type of ads you want to be displayed. Now, this is to do with the, the, the pre-roll stuff, the skippable and non-skippable ads, and can also uh, apply to mid-rolls, of course. Who wants a mid-roll that you can't skip? <laughs> but sometimes you get them, unfortunately. And then you get the option at the bottom, choose how to insert mid-roll ads. Your choices are schedule mid-roll ads at a set frequency. So you can set it to show an ad every X number of minutes, for example or you can choose to insert them manually. Now you can insert ads manually, you haven't been able to do that for a while at, on the live stream dashboard, I'll show you that right at the end. For the time being, the monetization default, so that's all there is. So I've set mine how I like them So already, so I'm gonna close that. Now when you go into uh, a live stream like this one that I've got prepped, you're gonna have a couple of things going on here. See, YouTube are really pushing this. Focus on your live stream and let YouTube insert ads for you. Turn on or dismiss, dismiss. I don't want YouTube doing that automatically. But what you'll see here is up the top here, you've got uh, enable monetization to insert ads. There's gonna be a button here, which will look like a, um, a dollar sign. At the moment, this live stream, I haven't set it up. It was set up before that monetization global settings was put in. So I have to go in and actually set that. But there, you'll get a button that has a dollar sign. So anytime you're streaming, and maybe you're gonna do a BRB, so you're dropping your BRB screen, you can roll an ad at the same time, so people aren't missing the content because you're, you know, taking a bio break or something. For me personally, as a live streamer, I wanna pick when the ads appear in the middle of the thing, like when I need to take like a breather for a second. So we'll be right back after this message, maybe do a BRB screen, because remember not everybody will get ads, people have premium, People um, may have just seen an ad and come in from a different video where they've seen an ad, so they're not gonna get that particular ad roll right in front of them at that time. So that's what I would say. So that's the ad settings for now. Remember, of course, when you go into a live stream that you've scheduled, you can click on edit here, and there is a whole monetization tab that applies to that specific stream. So you can see mine here is now set to on. It's basically the same settings, but this is where you can adjust it to maybe be different to your global settings. So this is the actual settings that are applied to your stream this one time. Well, that's the channel level settings so far for live streams, only monetization options right now, but it appears that this is like this, the similar to like the default settings that you might have for regular videos that appears in the settings tab of YouTube Studio. These channel level settings are probably gonna roll out to more live streaming functionality uh, going forward where you can set your channel defaults. Let me know if you're a live streamer and if this is something that's handy to automatically make sure that your monetization is turned on each time, then let me know in the comments below, give it a thumbs up and I will catch you in the next one. A big shout out and thank you to my channel members. You know who you are and I've listed you on screen.